Welcome to the Cisco Secure Endpoint Ransomware Series, where we'll discuss how Cisco Secure Endpoint defends you from ransomware attacks. In this video, we'll talk about how Cisco Secure Endpoint helps you achieve peace of mind with Secure Endpoint Pro. AJ, talk to me about the role that Endpoint Security plays um, at the end of the day, there's only kind of two things on the network. There's either an endpoint or there's something that it traverses to get to an endpoint, whether it's like a user's laptop or whether it's a server. So endpoint security is a critical component of an overall security architecture and a security approach. You know, maybe one of the most important components, especially in this day and age of end to end security. And um, the fact that if you don't have a presence on an endpoint or you're not monitoring what's happening on an endpoint, you're largely blind to a lot of attacks or a lot of the traffic that traverses the network because it is increasingly becoming encrypted, right? And so it becomes even, even more important, if you will, to make sure that you have a very, very strong endpoint security presence and the ability to monitor and very quickly remediate any time an adversary is able to gain a foothold or potentially gain access. So can you give us some examples? Why is it so important that we reduce the time it takes to identify and respond to a security threat? I think from an endpoint perspective, I'm going to talk about two different types of exploitations, for lack of a better term. Um, I think recently, you know, ransomware has certainly gotten a lot of visibility and a lot of airplay. Um, and from that standpoint, like, I don't know that, you know, reducing the time, reducing the time kind of, you know, it certainly helps because ransomware may move laterally throughout the network to the extent that you can reduce the time that the ransomware is in your network and keep it from moving laterally. You are going to reduce the blast radius of that ransomware locking up um, more devices. But if I think about another attack that lost a little bit of focus um, with the proliferation and rise of ransomware, that's just, you know, these very sophisticated um, nation state or crime syndicates the very sophisticated attacks that gain persistence in your network and sit there and not lock up machines because they actually don't want you to know that they're there. They're sitting there stealing intellectual property. Your data is gone, right? Like if you have an adversary that's sitting in your network for 24 hours, a large amount of your data is probably already gone. That's why it's so important to reduce that dwell time, if you will, as much as possible, um, just because of how quickly data can flow these days. So why is it so difficult to stay ahead of all of these threats if you don't have some kind of third party help? It's difficult because they're very sophisticated. But more than that, if you think about it, if you're an individual organization, the likelihood that you know how to respond to a very sophisticated attack, especially if it's the first time that you're seeing it, is very low. And the adversary is constantly adapting their tactics, techniques, and procedures, or TTPs, and so you have to not only identify this new attack, but then you have to figure out how best to respond to it, all of the intricacies. If you have help, for example, if you have a vendor like Cisco who supports thousands of customers, the likelihood that it's the first time we've seen an attack is very low, which means we probably know how to respond to it very quickly. We know how to identify it. We know the things that customers need to be thinking about. You know, in many cases, we can block the attack or we can stop the attack because we've already learned from it. Um, but also we have all of the experience that's been gained by helping support other customers who may have been impacted by it that we can bring to bear very quickly. Probably the biggest benefit, if you will, of having a partner that organizations don't have to go it alone. They don't have to rely on their own people to very quickly get smart or be smarter than the adversary. They have the benefit of hundreds of thousands of customers of that same vendor that probably have seen that attack before and that vendor being able to, to apply the best practices in order to help that specific customer deal with it um, at that point in time. So we actually have a new solution. And right. so tell us a little bit how that works. It's not just a product with a service added on later, but it's a solution. I mean, you're buying a product and a service all at once. So tell us, how does that intertwine and work? We just released a new offer called Secure Endpoint Pro folks can think of that as a managed detection and response offer that leverages the incredible Cisco Secure Endpoint product that we have, as well as the Secure X product, right? So it starts with a very, very good endpoint security product along with Secure X. 
And then what we do is we bring people and really kind of wrap that plot with a managed detection and response service so that organizations who either don't have the people or don't have the expertise or don't have both can have Cisco either take some or all of that responsibility for managing those endpoints, constantly threat hunting or looking for the adversary or, or identifying whether or not persistence has been gained, and then very quickly make recommendations on remediation or if the customer chooses, have Cisco take the action right away in order to kind of clean up those endpoints, remediate them. Yeah, it it's, starts with our product, Cisco Secure Endpoint, as well as SecureX, and then puts people that work right alongside our customers um, gives our customers the opportunity to hand over that responsibility to Cisco and manage that endpoint security on their behalf. Well, that's great because I know it's it's a difficult thing for a lot of customers out there to do, and a lot of them I think would just love to hand that over to us and let us manage that for them. Yeah, not not just hand it over to us, but a lot of them, especially larger organizations, have teams that can do this. But they may not have all of the people that they need, right? So you can almost kind of think of it as like augmenting their staff, right? And not just that, but having a trusted partner literally sit in that right seat, you know, with them and generally just make sure that we're there to support them. If they have questions, we can answer them right away. If they want to get access to our Talos Threat Intelligence, we can feed that into them right away. And so we are more than happy to be right there with them, working down in the trenches day to day, helping keep their, their environment secure. Learn more about Cisco Secure Endpoint and sign up for a free trial today. Go to cisco.com slash go slash endpoint.